In this tutorial, I'm going to show you a quick way to add camera shake to your footage without using any plugins. Now, obviously, there's some plugins that make more realistic camera shake, but this is a nice default just built right into After Effects. So this first one here, I'm going to use a wider shot. I just want to add a slight camera shake to the whole shot. So go into your effects and type in wiggle and find wiggle position under behaviors. I'm going to slap that on top and you're going to see the default is speed one amount 50. Now you can play and just see what that looks like on its own. For a longer clip like this and where the camera is supposed to be wider farther away, it's too much movement. Like it looks really fake. Obviously you want to match it to your music. So if you have intense music going on, you would want more camera shake. But for me, it's just too much for this shot here. So what I'm going to do is change the speed to 0.2 and the amount to 30. And really you just got to play with it and test it. So now I'm going to play again. It's got a little amount. So my, I might even went a little too much on there. But you see that these black lines, or at least a part of the frame, moves too far, revealing the black edges. And the trick to that is you just go New, Adjustment Layer, type in Transform. It'll be under Distort, but you type in Transform. Put it on the adjustment layer above and change the scale to like 110 or something. Now obviously before you even add camera shake to any of your shots, you should play around with the position scale rotation and really create the composition you want and have it move and rotate and everything. You can see here, just looks a little more organic now, there's something going on there. Alright, here's another example, but this time instead of just adding camera shake to the whole shot, we're going to put uh, emphasis on when a character gets shot, having the camera shake more and also when the character hits the ground having the camera shake more so it's realistic as if the camera's right there look up your wiggle position put it on this time I'm going to dial it down at the beginning so I have like 0.2 uh, 50 is fine so have it go normally as soon as he gets shot right before he gets shot actually I'm going to put a keyframe and as he gets shot for like three frames I'm going to change it to uh, let's go one so it goes a little then shakes when he gets shot then we're going to have it shake even more when he hits the ground so hit you, bring up your keyframes, and right when his body looks like it's hitting the ground, put a keyframe where it already is at one, and then two keyframes after, we're going to put it to two. So yeah, there we go. So he shot and he shakes when he hits the ground. Obviously you still have to put an adjustment layer and play with uh, transform to get rid of the frame issues on the side, basically just scaling it in. You could scale in right on the clip, but I like to do this. And there, it looks like the camera is shaking when the character gets shot and when the character hits the ground.